Okay, it's time to go to bed. Uh, I've just moved in the fire a bit. I tried to how how this would work out, and I came up with uh, no good idea for bedding. So I took three large stones from uh, my from the firing and uh, bury them under me and now uh, I won't get wet and cold from underneath anymore and then I move the fire closer closer up so well we'll see if I can sleep a bit better uh, and um, Today has most of the part been boiling water and uh, getting firewood and building the shelter. The shelter took a lot of calories and uh, I've uh, even now in the evening I got a headache so I had to boil uh, some uh, willow bark tea which uh, which tastes awful but is supposed to work like a like a painkiller so and it's actually working it's uh, it's uh, i have a, a bit more relief feeling at the moment so uh, i hope i will get some sleep i will take my bandana and uh, put it over my face so the mosquitoes will leave me alone that was a big problem today as well uh, they were all over but uh, most of the time it was quite windy and sunny so I don't know where the headache came from did it come from the fire because I've been drinking a lot and uh, I don't know is it salt or is it uh, water or is it sunny weather I don't know why but uh, I do have a slight headache left but let's hope it will pass okay I'll talk to you tomorrow okay uh, I of course can't sleep so um, the headache is uh, almost gone now but I was thinking uh, why not try out the coffee uh, substitute with the dandelion so I am maintain maintaining my fire and um, I'm gonna brew me some coffee I just roasted the, the roots okay Here's the coffee from Dandelion Roots. Well, I don't know. It's something warm to drink, and uh, maybe I can get some sleep after this. Okay? Not too bad, not too bad, but if it tastes like coffee, in the neighborhood maybe. This is the new gear that I've been testing uh, during this uh, survival challenge. Uh, it's a new Nalgene bottle and a nesting cup and uh, I must say both of these have uh, performed very well. Here's something I found. Uh, it's a fish trap all uh, trashed up. It was on the island. Uh, I found it 
yesterday evening but I was so tired so I didn't think of anything to do with it so I'm gonna try to see if I can it's uh, the similar type of netting that I found to my fireplace well I'm gonna see if I can uh, take and use this rope for something or uh, maybe make some hooks or whatever for fishing okay okay making a pitch stick I'm putting some uh, some of this pitch that I found earlier yesterday uh, on a hot rock and uh, collecting it on a stick like this There you go. Pitch glue. Here's a fly I made just right now. I'm gonna and some cordage from a bigger big nylon cord. It's only a maybe foot and a half long. Okay, it's time to go home. Uh, I learned a lot these 24 hours. I uh, especially like that uh, the willow tea as a painkiller worked. It took away my headache. I really like the dandelion coffee it was great when I couldn't sleep and the cons or the not so polite experiences was the roots I was about to cook uh, the food I made uh, was not that good I only read about it I tried it now I know and um, what else? Yeah, I made my shelter. It was uh, too cold. Uh, that's why I couldn't sleep. So um, I'm, I got real. I'm almost expecting rain. So um, the weather is kind of bad. So that's. Uh, uh, I should have taken a wool shirt with me, uh, which I always do. But I did really like to try to Cotton Church next time, I know. Uh, if I would have continued today, I would be making more fishing equipment. I found me rope, I found me some metal so I could make hooks, I can make traps. Uh, I would probably go to the forest over there and uh, pick some berries so uh, that would be my next goal to get some protein uh, and uh, move around a bit okay thank you all for watching hello to all my subscribers and friends and uh, I'll catch you on the next video you all take care now bye bye